All right, last time on the button, we found beautiful hipster love. And what will we find today? Let's find out. For those of you that are new here, this is the Cut Speed Dating Show. It's called The Button. Basically, the way it works is you sit across from someone at a table, and if you don't like the look of their stupid face or whatever, maybe they got like a stupid nose or something like that, you hit the button, and then you get the next person. It's absolutely ruthless. It's cutthroat. It's probably the hardest core dating show I've ever seen, and that includes... Uh, Naked Attraction, the one that's on in the UK where they're just naked on national television. Just like, a f you know, families making fun of your dick and balls just without you being able to hear it. That's ruthless, right? This is worse to me. It is. So uh, let's get into this episode. Welcome to The Button, a speed dating show. When the button lights up red, either player may press it and swap out their date for a new person. You have been eliminated. If two people can last on a date for 10 minutes, they win an all expenses paid second date. Welcome to the button. The date begins now. Hello. Hi. Hi, I'm Bjork. Jimmy, nice meeting nice you. Nice to meet you. Just want to say I'm super nervous. Okay. That's fine. We're all nervous up in here. Oh, oh, what was that? What was this? What was the face touch thing? What was that? <laughs> I'm just fucking, I'm really nervous right now. And I, I actually, well, I'm actually really hopped up. I just did a bunch of coke in the bathroom. And so I can't necessarily feel my face at all. So if it looks like I'm having a stroke, that's why. Anyways, what do you do? Uh, tell me about yourself. I'm an artist. I'm obsessed with societal issues and try to find a solution to that and cool. uh, just be really aware of the problems going on in our society. Ah, a fellow artist, I see. A tip of the beret to you, my friend. <laughs> he likes to tackle societal issues. And me, I like to butcher Bob Ross paintings in Photoshop, but that's the beauty of art, right? Art. More like fart. York is a little emotionally unavailable. You are? I am. <laughs> okay, because I feel a ton of emotions coming from that uh, pink shirt. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot there, but I don't really date. Jimmy has been a magician since he was six years old. Oh, no. Oh, no. Button. Don't do my mans like that. Oh. I agree the pink shirt joke didn't really land, in my opinion. It was a little bit awkward, but you don't gotta expose him for being a magician since he was six years old. What the fuck do you think that's gonna do? What do you think that's gonna do? You think she's gonna be like, ooh, what? <laughs> a magician? Oh, how mysterious. So sexy. <laughs> Show me a card trick, you sexy man. <laughs> Let's see that. Why don't you yeah, what what number what number am I thinking? I'll give you a hint. Sixty. Ooh, why don't, you, why don't you pull a rabbit out of my vagina? No, I can feel her getting ready. I can feel her palms sweating right now. She's getting ready to You've been a magician since you were six. Mm -hmm. Tell me about being a magician. Well, cause I was bullied in elementary school. So you picked up magic? <laughs> to combat bullying? Weird choice. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like magic. I think magic's cool. We all secretly think it's pretty cool. When you get a, someone does a good trick to you, you're like, holy fuck, but it's like the most made fun of thing ever. Being a magician? And that's how you decided to combat the bullying? Ugh. I feel like I know what's gonna happen here too. That's the worst part. One time I just saw this lady doing a uh, performance in the mall. So I was like really intrigued by it. I think everyone is inherently curious and I wanna bring that curiosity to people. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, this show just never ceases to exceed my expectations of how brutal it can be, truly. This dude was just pouring his heart out about how he overcame being bullied as a child by finding his passion. And yes, it was magic, but whatever. We're not judging. And then the whole time she's just eyeing the button. You can see her eyes just, just, oh yeah. Oh yeah, in her head she's like, when when can I fucking press this thing? Enough of this sob story. Like, oh my god, I've had enough of this fucking sob story. I mean, he's bullied as a child. Why don't you make like a magician and disappear? <laughs> hey, I'm thinking of a number between zero and fuck you. Poor Jim, man. I'm sorry, Jim. You deserve better than this. Sorry, Jimmy. <laughs> you now must leave. <laughs> 
That was so mean. He just told me like such a deep thing. And I just next did him so hard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Bjork. Bjork, I'm Jasmine. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you too. The date begins now. You said your name was Bjork, yes. right? Okay, cool. Like the singer. Yep. Just like the singer. Um, yeah. Jasmine is a model. I can gather that. Oh, thank you. Cool. So tell me about yourself. <laughs> oh! Owned! Tell me about yourself. Well, um, well, I love to, I love to press this fucking button. Boom! So tell me about yourself. Well, bye! Here's a little something about me. I love to click this fucking button right now. Sorry. Sorry, this is an aggressive episode for me. I just, there's something, there's something in it when someone rejects someone and then they get rejected right after without even a chance to, to, so tell me about yourself. <laughs> Whew, I'm in a mood, dude. I want to see someone headbutt the button. How metal would that be? How metal would that be? Just, what is it, Bjork? Fall! <laughs> oh, you're a waitress? Cool. Fall! Ow. Oh, you're, what is it? You said you're a waitress? Cool. Fall! Oh, what? You do data analysis? Sick! You like Star Wars? Sick! Fall! Oh, you you make music? Cool. Someone just turns around and rips a fart on it. Bye bye, Bjork. Why did you eliminate her? Can I wait till she leaves? <laughs> okay. <laughs> it felt like an interview instead of like a date. I don't know. I felt like I was applying for a job. You didn't want that job? No. <laughs> Alright. Why do they leave that stuff in? It's like they want this show to be as uncomfortable as possible. Seriously. <laughs> Hi. I'm Tyson. Hi Tyson. Nice to meet you. Jasmine, nice Jasmine. to meet you too. Wow, you're very beautiful. Now. Thank you. Oh, what's your favorite, what do you like to do? Oh, I love to read. Tyson is 19. Oh my God, you're a baby. I am 19 okay, years I, old. Okay, I'm so sorry. <gasps> Okay. Sorry, Tyson. <laughs> okay. Oh, he wasn't ready for that at all. You could tell. He was like, oh, what? <laughs> That's what this is? 19 again? I mean, he at least he actually looks 19. Um, you know, our, our dude Aaron or whatever his name was before, the nerd guy, he had the full beard and everything. He looked about 35. This dude actually looks, he has a little bit of a baby face. He looks 19. Why are they even bringing 19-year-olds onto the show in the first place? Why are you, why are you bringing teenagers to a speed dating Thing. Like they, these people, 19, you just got out of your awkward phase in life. And what, you're gonna go just get rejected before you can even say hello? What's that gonna do for the self esteem? <laughs> Not a lot. Hi. What's your name? Brooke. Brooke, I'm Jasmine. Nice, nice to meet, meet you. you. You're beautiful. Oh, thank you. You I'm, too. I can tell you care about your appearance. Yeah. Yeah. Hold hands for 10 seconds and stare deeply into <laughs> each other's eyes. Pretty eyes. Me too. Thank you. The button is not impartial at all. It picks favorites. What is this? You know holding hands is gonna encourage some sort of emotional connection. You know that. And yet the first guy you're gonna He was a magician! What a fucking nerd! <laughs> What's next? What's next here? Suck on each other's boobs. But I don't know, who knows? Maybe the you know the button could be all knowing. It is the button. You know, so maybe he knows that these two people are destined to be soulmates or something. Let's find out. You have pretty eyes. You too. Thank you. Yeah. Natural what color. Are they? Like hazel. Same, but okay. hazel green. Yeah. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> this is fun. I know. I don't really meet people out of bars or anything, so this is nice. When's the last time you went on a date? Six months ago. Really? No, no, like five months. <laughs> Or, or four, or, you know, three. Or, I mean, I can't really remember. Or, or zero, actually. This is a date, so zero seconds. So I'm on a date right now. So whatever you want to hear, just please. I haven't had the loving embrace of anyone in forever. So <laughs> don't hit the button, please. Don't hit it. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. <laughs> every time. Every time that hurts me, too. Every time. Why did you reject her? I don't know. I felt like I was really driving the conversation. How are you? I'm well. What's your name? I'm Jasmine. Jasmine and Britt. The date begins 
now. Are you nervous? Yes, very much so. <laughs> yeah. My mom put a lot of pressure on this. Why? Does she want you to... It's speed dating and she said, like, 20 people, I'm bound to find somebody. Your mom thought you'd find love at the Cut Studio? Really? Something tells me that most of these people are here for the day rate, not for, uh, because they want to find love, but... Again, who knows? Maybe that's me just being a pessimist. Classic. Oh. Yeah. So she, she wants you to settle down. It's time. Yeah. yeah. For her. <laughs> do either of you own a gun? Um, uh, I do not own a gun. Do you own a gun? I do. That's awesome. Classic. Classic gun talk on a first date. <laughs> That's such a such a cliche nowadays, just talking guns. It was the exact same thing happened on Kelsey and I's first date, honestly. She was like, did you bring a gun? And I was like, I sure did. And she was like, me too. And I was like, no shit. And then on the, on the second date, she actually brought an RPG. And that's when I knew. She's the girl for me, you know? Rip is divorced. Dude, this face says it all right here. This... <laughs> She's like, I was about to, I was about to fulfill my mom's wishes. I was literally about to find love at the cut soundstage. And you had to, you had to air out my dirty laundry like that. Classic button. <laughs> yes, I am. Do you have any kids? No, I do not, no. Would you get married again? Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh okay. yeah, for, for sure. For the right person. For the right person. Cool. Yeah. So what do you do for fun? I'm a performer, actually. So I do um, high femme, like AFAB drag and splice in some burlesque because I can't keep my clothes on. So. Really? Yeah, it's fun. The burlesque thing, mm -hmm. that interests me because that's something that I kind of been- I'm feeling, I'm feeling the, I'm seeing the sparks fly here. I'm seeing the sparks fly. This is going well. And we're nearing the end of the video. So that's gotta be a good sign. I'm wanting to get into. I grew up dancing. Nice, tell me about your background. Um, ballet, tap, jazz, okay. a little bit of hip hop. Hip hop, oh. Oh, you're, you're a dancer, oh cool, cool. Hip hop, what did you say? Hip hop, jazz, and cool, what do you think of this move? What do you think of, oh, oh shit, oh. I, I don't know, that was supposed to be like a Dougie type thing, but I, I, oh, ah! What about, oh, oh, <laughs> what about that move, huh? No, I'm kidding. They seem like they'd be great for each other, honestly. I wish I could dance, but I am simply a button. Oh my God, shut it. Put a, put a sock in it, button. Seriously. Although, you know what? I, I'm honestly starting to like the button a little bit. Guilty. That's when I start craving that voice, you know, the button voice. Once they're once they're like, oh yeah, did, did you fudge us that, that, that? Oh yeah, bitch, that, 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 that. I would want the button to be. Janelle has fifteen DUIs. What's it like having herpes? Congratulations, <laughs> you have won the button. You get to go on an all expenses paid awesome. second date. <laughs> I hope you're hungry. Yeah. No, now, right now, say I love you. I love you, Button. I love you, Button. You know what? I love you too, Button. I do. I love you. And look at that. Another happy couple gets to hit the town on the cut's dime. And I'm very, I'm stoked about that. It's great. I just, I just, I, I don't know. I just can't help but think what, what's the magician guy doing right now? What's the, what's our magician boy doing? He's probably at home watching YouTube videos, learning some insane new trick to win her back. That's what he's doing. He's sitting there thinking, Oh, 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 you buttoned me? Wait till I escape these chains underwater. <laughs> I don't know. See you guys next time. <laughs>